Dear Elizabeth, I imagine the fields of Lansbury are beautiful now, blooming with the dawn and shining in the sun. I was shot in the leg last week, but don't worry, they took good care of me. William gave his all to bring me out of the trench. I want to tell you what it's like to be here, so I can imagine you're here with me. They brought me to the CCS, where they had to choose who to save and who would die. This is the last one we can afford to save. Leave all the others. Poor men. Life here is hell, but it's better than being in the trenches. They're trying to make more room and make things better, but it's hard. I got on the table quickly. The German who shot me had more sympathy in his eyes than the surgeon. They're exhausted, but they're still doing their best. We can't do a good job under these conditions. Where are the bandages I asked for? Some of them keep scouting for supplies. It's a dangerous thing to do during these troubled times, and they have to make tough decisions. Will they ever forgive us, Sergeant? I can hear the whistle blowing. New soldiers are coming, and I have to join them. I'm ready to go back, but I'm not sure my mind is. If you ever meet a chap that says he wants to go back, call him a liar. I'll love you forever. You're Jack. <laughs>